brewers are really welcoming. You offer somebody a beer, they will be your friend. If you offer somebody something that you've made, you've pretty much made a friend for life. I realized my beer was good, but I realized that if I really wanted it to be better, I really needed more help, and books will only get you so far. It's a great hobby. Uh, at the end of the day, you know, how many people get to drink their hobby? One of the other things I really enjoy doing is being able to be out in the craft beer community and talking with people about craft beer and home brewing in particular. If you can brew a couple batches with somebody else who's done it for a while, you can save yourself so much you know, pain and anguish. Your beer will be so much better. You know, I always tell people, join your, your local club, and, and here it's the Oregon Brew Crew. My name is John D. Benedetti, and I helped found the Oregon Brew Crew in 1979. early 80s there were maybe 15 members there or maybe 10 you know we'd go to a house and sit around and, and uh, discuss brewing and uh, have some beers. So we started our relationship in 1988 with the Oregon Brew Crew and we still have that relationship today with the Brewers Festival and it gives the the patrons an opportunity to see on a small scale how beer is really made and the Brew Crew started out being servers and then they graduated to being supervisors and both of us we've kind of grown together in that part of the process. Volunteerism is, is part of uh, the nature of the guys in it. Uh, coming from a, a homebrew background uh, that the camaraderie, that uh, desire to, to share and educate other people uh, is really strong and I know our mission statement is really to create uh, unique and, and different beers and to educate uh, the beer lover. Part of my homebrew roots is to kind of innovate and make people think about beer in different ways. We volunteer at festivals, uh, we educate people who want to be home brewers and we educate people who are into wanting to judge beer. We show people extract brewing, we show people um, all grain brewing, we walk through like the systems and how easy it is, especially if they want to move from being a home brewer to being a professional craft brewer. It seems so much more plausible that they can make that final step and a lot of people when they move into going um, professional started out as home brewers. This is probably one of the most unique synergies between a home brewer and a professional company uh, because they actually do care about the brewing community and they wanted to step out and say, hey, you know, we've got to showcase this. These home brewers, they really do know how to brew and people need to drink this beer. It's a really big deal because it definitely ties in the connection with Woodmere and every year they have showed their commitment to the home brew industry and where their roots are and the importance of home brewing by doing this competition, which definitely encourages our members to brew more and brew more interesting beers and push the envelope. The money we raise from the sales go towards the Bob McCracken Scholarship, which then gets put towards OSU, and that money funds a scholarship for students in the fermentation sciences. So it really helps, you know, not only the guy making the beer with our, our brewers, but, but uh, you know, future brewers that are, are enrolled at OSU in Fermentation Sciences Project. Cheers. 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 Cheers.